Hello. I'm on my favorite street. I'm enjoying a warm day before the cold comes. It was pretty cool last night. I didn't have to turn on the air conditioning. So I saved uh, $3 there. Uh, yes, yeah, so I'm here. I got to do this that time of the week. I, I got to buy some groceries. So I already picked up a few things and uh, I'm, I'm cooking uh, a chicken style Chinese uh, dinner tonight for myself and a couple of friends. So that's what I'm doing. Uh, nothing exciting, uh, you know, I'm trying to get into uh, United Music Group, or oh, what is that, yeah, United Music, uh, it's, yeah, I think they're a subdivision of Sony Records, I'm not, I'm not quite sure, but it, yeah, so, you know, I'm, uh, I, uh, to some people there, you never know. They they may just uh, hire me. I, cause uh, I'm, you know, home all day. I can't take it no more. Except you know, I, I have a dog, so I, you know, a, a little guy. So I, you know, I, I can't leave him alone every day. You know, maybe I could work uh, four or five hours a day and then go home. You know. But uh, yeah, so you know, I'm, that's what I'm I'm up to. So hopefully, cross your fingers for me. I'll be with uh, United uh, uh, United. What is that? Uh, Universal Music. That's that's who I'll be with. Uh, as a uh, in, in, you know, in the upper management uh, producer type thing, you know. So. I'll see what happens, and uh, cross your fingers for me, because uh, you know I, I, I like the job, and you know maybe I can help a few people get uh, into the music business. We'll see, because I have a few people in mind that I'm I'm, I'm uh, thinking uh, that I can uh, uh, make it go with them. You know what I'm saying? So there you go. You never know. Life is funny. You know. I'm going to make a call and see what happens. So if I get in, I'll let you know right away. All right, so here I am, and uh, it's a beautiful day, so I wanted to take advantage of getting a little sun before uh, it goes away and we see nothing again. <laughs> there you go. All right, guys. Nice to see you again. It's me, Joe, with the Two Old Guys show. People, people, people. You're making a big deal out of this pussy thing. You know, I like pussy. Everybody likes pussy. Tell me one guy that don't talk about pussy. Come on. Even religious people talk about pussy. Uh, Hillary Clinton just shouts because I get pussy. Well, she gets pussy too. You know, her husband's a pussy. And he sticks cigars in pussies. And, uh, excuse me, sign of CDs. My hair almost flew off that time. Oh, the sinus problems. I gotta, I gotta stop doing the coke. Anyway, let's get back to pussy. I like pussy. Hey, she likes pussy too. So I don't know why we can't get along. Okay, anyway. That's enough of this bullshit. Anyway, uh, yeah, anybody watched the debate last night? I know you guys watched the debate. You couldn't have been watching football. If uh, you're a politician, uh, I love politics. But you know what? They were both good. They were both good. Uh, one better than the other. I'm not going to say who because last time I did, I, I was favoring one. I lost a lot of friends, you know. Uh, just It's politics, you know what I'm saying? It's politics. Uh, may the best man or woman win uh, whatever America decides. Well, I got my... Uh, person picked anyway uh, yeah so uh, there's a lot of stupidness going on on Facebook and other people are really taking this uh, this uh, voting uh, election year you know um, 
very serious, you know. It is serious. I mean, the economy's in jeopardy, you know. There's a lot of stuff that, I mean, we're really going down the drain, you know. With 20, 20 billion dollars in debt, billions and trillion, 20 trillion dollars in, in deficit. Yeah. Bro, man, this is a lot of money, man. Anyway, I don't know. I, this is not looking good for anybody. Uh, I'm worried. Yeah, I'm worried, man. You know, for the future. Even though I ain't got much to live, but, you know, I got kids and family, and, you know, grandchildren and stuff. And great grandchildren that, you know, we need to leave them a future, you know what I'm saying? Just because we fucked it up. Anyway, so I'm at the store. Daily routine. You know, we do the same shit all the time. Uh, so I'm going to head in there. Uh, and then I'm going to... It's Columbus Day. Hey, goodbye, goodbye. Happy Columbus Day to all my Italian friends. All my Italian friends. And uh, I'm going to head home after that. Just, uh, I don't know, I'm going to take it off today, tomorrow. Uh, and then I'll go to work Wednesday, Thursday. I believe I can't fly. I believe I can't fly! I used to think that I could not. I love abandoned places. I used to go to abandoned places all the time, and uh, on my own, by myself, yeah. I didn't go with nobody. I don't love to go in creepy places. Nothing scares me. I'm crazy. Well, what can they do? Kill me? Joba! <laughs> anyway, listen, I gotta, I gotta go back to my video. I gotta go home soon. I think it's like 3 o'clock, 3.30, somewhere around there. And, uh, I don't know, I, uh, I'll tell you all about it later. I went to a party last night, and, um, when I got home, I had to sit in the car for two hours. I couldn't find parking, so I parked by a pump, and I got a $115 ticket. It's a piece, a bunch of bullshit with these parking around my area. I'll tell you about it later. Hey, guess what? It's pouring outside. <laughs> Here I am again. I got to do a couple of things. It's that time of the week. So, uh, yeah, I'm just bopping around, getting all wet, but I came into my favorite spot to have a coffee. <laughs> because I'm frugal. That's what. Right. But anyway, yeah, it's starting to get cold. It's 60 degrees in New York City and rainy. So, uh... Yeah, I don't like to carry an umbrella. I just wear a hat. It's pretty good. This hat <laughs> beads the rain off my head, and um, I got my leather, classic leather, leather jacket, and it's, it repels the rain pretty good, too, so that's what I'm doing. Hey, wish us uh, luck. Uh, we're going to release a new song. It'll be on iTunes soon, and uh, I'll give you a heads up when it comes out. All right. Hey, I'll give you $1,000 if you tell me where I'm at. Nope. Nope. I'm still at work. <laughs> no good, no good for you. I don't smoke. I'm not scared of heights, okay? I'm scared of bees, I'm scared of snakes, and I'm scared that the Knicks might never be good again, but I am not scared of heights. We're gonna die, 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 we're gonna die. I'm telling you, people are the stupidest people in the world. They don't know how to fucking drive. It really irks me when I fucking have to drive. You know, just now, there was a car making a left turn, I'm behind him. So when he makes a left turn, I'm, I move towards my right to go around him a little bit. The car behind me is already on my right side, cutting me off. What the, a fucking woman. I hate when women drivers, I'm sorry women, if you're drivers, but some of you really fucking suck. 
you know? Oh my God, this is like, it, it just irks me, man. You know? And then, and then there's no parking in this fucking area. I don't know what the hell is going on. The other day I got a $115 ticket because I was, I left my nephew's birthday. All right? It was 12 o'clock at night. I come home. You think you find a little fucking parking so you can go home. You're tired. And we were there since 4 o'clock. I get home, there's no parking. Two hours later, I'm still sitting in the car. My poor wife was in the house waiting for me because she, could, she couldn't handle it no more. She just had to go in the house. You know what I'm saying? So I go in the house. And, uh, I, I finally, I just said, uh, fuck it. I found a, a parking and it was very close to a pump. I just took my chances and said, you know, yeah, I'm just going to park in. Maybe I'll, I'll get over. No, 6 o'clock in the morning, they come and they give me a fucking ticket. 115 fucking dollars, you know? Listen, I, I don't know, I don't know, you know, it just, I don't know what's going on in this fucking neighborhood, man. I really don't know. And then there's all cars that you don't fucking know. It's just like, where do these cars fucking come from? Jesus Christ, man. Anyway, I'm not going to have a heart attack today, okay? It's, today's Thursday, and I just want to smooth it out, you know what I'm saying? Smooth it out. It's a beautiful day. I'm going to go in the house. I just got paid. I went to the check cashing, just got paid. And half of it, the more my wife's gonna go do her hair, keratin in her hair. I don't know, fucking $200 fucking shit. I just got paid to pay for her keratin. Uh, anyway, hey, listen. I know what she was all about when I first met her. She's high, she's high, uh, function, high, uh, whatever. You know, nails, uh, hair, whatever. Everything's expensive. She's Greek, what do you want? <laughs> hey, listen, I've been paying it for years. But she pays the other bills, so. One hair washes the other, one hair washes the other, and both hairs wash the face. You know what I'm saying? This is why we get along, because I have no problem with money, you know. And I'm still saving, you know. I don't know how, but some people live paycheck to paycheck, I don't, you know. I, I just put away, you know, you have to learn five, ten, fifteen dollars. Whatever you gotta do, you gotta do what you gotta do when you gotta do it. You understand? Let me say that again. You gotta do what you gotta do when you gotta do it. That's it. That that's my motto, you know? If you want it done, you gotta do it, you gotta do it, you gotta do it. <laughs> anyway, listen. I'm gonna go in the house, I'm gonna vegetate. I was gonna go out later and go to the store, but I'm afraid, man. You know, I have to carry fucking bags and there's no parking. I don't know. Maybe I'll go tomorrow. My wife is going away. She's going to go stay, stay at her sister's. Because tomorrow she's doing her keratin treatment at 9 o'clock in the morning. Her sister's going to take it to the beauty salon. Because I ain't sitting at no beauty salon. must know me by Pookie. Yeah, my name is Pookie. I used to be on the Soupy Sales show. <laughs> I'm not the same since Soupy Sales died. <laughs> now on with the show. So let me close this vlog out, you know, and uh, just uh, thank everybody. I appreciate everybody. Come on, push that like button, subscribe. Even if you don't like us, su subscribe. A lot of people think we're idiots, but hey, listen, we're 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 old idiots, you know. Just try to put a smile on your face. Uh, not everybody's gonna like this channel, you know, but it's the best we can do for now, you know, with what we got. We're just trying to, like I said, create create some harmony, put a smile on your face, and um, you know, show you some love, you know, show us some love, some love back. Anyway, from Joe and I and uh, my son Gil, you know, we, like I said, appreciate you, love you, and ciao for now.